Vern Troyer has died at the age of 49 on April 21, according to a Facebook post on his verified account. The news comes just one week after the actor, who's best known for playing Mini-Me in the Austin Powers franchise, was hospitalized earlier this month after cops received a report that he was drunk and suicidal. Vern was also a fighter when it came to his own battles. Over the years he's struggled and won, struggled and fought some more, but unfortunately this time was too much, the Facebook statement said. During this time of adversity he was baptized while surrounded by his family. The family appreciates that they have this time to grieve privately. Troyer was hospitalized on April 2 where he was treated for possible alcohol poisoning, TMZ reported. Law enforcement sources also told the website that one of the actor's friends made a call to police around 7.30 p.m. in which he said Troyer was very upset, drunk, and suicidal. At the time, it was reported that he would stay in the hospital for three days in order to be evaluated, but it was unclear what would happen after that time passed. Depression and suicide are very serious issues. You never know what kind of battle someone is going through inside. Be kind to one another, and always know, it's never too late to reach out to someone for help, the Facebook message said. The statement also asked for loved ones to donate to either of Troyer's favorite charities. The Starkey Hearing Foundation and Best Buddies, in lieu of sending flowers. Troyer was born with achondroplasia dwarfism, which is a genetic disorder that caused him to be one of the shortest men in the world at 2 feet 8 inches. He was born in Sturgis, Michigan to Susan, a factory worker, and Reuben Troyer, a repair technician. His parents initially raised him and his two siblings, Devon and Deborah, as Amish but left the religion when he was still a child. Troyer has also said that he was never treated differently by his parents than their other two average-sized children. Troyer began his career in Hollywood as a stunt double for Baby Bink in the 1994 film Baby's Day Out. He then went on to have small roles in movies like Jingle All the Way and Men in Black, in 1999. He found success as Mini-Me in Austin Powers, The Spy Who Shagged Me. He also starred in Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone as Grip Hook. Our thoughts are with Vern's family, friends, and fans during this incredibly devastating time.